possibilities. Experiments, research, and data analysis done by dozens of elementary school students here at Montreal's John Cavato Academy for their first ever science fair. Let's go. When the, Mr. Alex told us that we were going to do a science fair project, she told me, do you want to make stickers with me? And I go, sure. It would be a nice idea because no one else is doing it. So. And everyone loves stickers. From sticker making, soap creating, to volcanoes and slime. Oh, that's really slimy. The grade four to six students showcased their scientific discoveries and creations in the school's gymnasium, projects that they've been working on for over three months with their science teacher. I think science, STEAM education is the new way of learning. You know, STEAM is very, you find the problem and you try to solve it using innovative thinking, using creativity. Our objective is to build an air hockey table by using re recycled materials. We took uh, empty toilet paper bottles and we glued them at the bottom with hot glue, spray painted it with black spray paint. The Science and STEAM Fair also welcomed renowned chemist Yannick Bergeron, who hosted a science show for all visitors. And the event, filled with brain power, was open to the community to enjoy after school hours. That is what we're showing our community, that our students love science, they love STEAM, and here's just a testament of their hard work. There is this software called Tinkercad, where you can import images and essentially um, make them 3D. It takes about 9 to 10 hours to make every, like, all of them. And we also made, like, friendship ones. So this says best and that says friends. I love so, that! Yeah. This is so cute. Oh, are you best friends? Yeah. <laughs> I love that. All my students of grade 4, both my classes of grade 5 and grade 6, all have impressed me. <laughs> you will either work or not work, but still you're having fun. In Montreal, Pamela Pagano. See you.